Hey guys, if you can't tell, it's out. I'm so fucking excited about it. This is Destroy All Humans. This is the remastered version of a late 90s game that set off a chain reaction for me, and by that I mean playing video games. It It's great. It's unbelievable. So, I'm trying to contain my excitement. It's very difficult. I'm going to make this video a little bit longer than the rest, just because this is going to have the intro and a lot of tutorials in it, because I'm leaving that on, um, just to kind of get myself re-acclimated to the game, and it has been about 12 years since I've played this, uh, and I've been told that there are some differences, but it's mostly the same. I'm going to leave all the cutscenes in, obviously, and I'm going to try not to talk as much as I normally would in a video so that you can enjoy the funny, witty humor that uh, Crypto usually kind of dishes out along the way. So, let's get into it. I have played one just to make sure everything worked right. Sometimes OBS doesn't like full screen versus exclusive versus windowed, so I, I did play one. Uh, just the beginning intro and everything just to make sure that everything was working. So but we are going to go ahead and start a new game. Hello, friends. Have you ever gazed up into the night sky and wondered at the possibility of life on other planets? What marvelous beings might exist out there? Hands extended in friendship awaiting the moment when we humans take our first tentative steps into space. What tales will be told of that glorious day when we are first contacted by our brothers from beyond the stars? Five. All systems go, General. Four. Come on, baby, show us what you got. Three. What the hell? Two. What in the blue blazes is that? One. No, wait, stop the countdown. Incompetent fool. I should never have sent you. What's shaking, Pox? You look a little, what's the word, constipated. <sighs> Let's just say I hope you turn out to be less of an evolutionary dead end than your predecessor. You lost me. Shall I tell you a secret? Few of our people know this. But the DNA patterns in our cloning banks are becoming more and more degraded with each new clone. That's bad, right? Only if we want to retain our immortality through cloning. Of course it's bad! I sent Crypto-136 in search of a planet we visited many eons ago. A planet seeded with pure Furon DNA. But I lost contact. Let me get this straight. You sent me, uh, him. Crypto-136 to a hostile planet, and he's disappeared. Maybe captured, maybe even being tortured as we speak. Well, I wouldn't jump to any conclusion. I bet you wouldn't. Let me tell you something, Pox. You're a smart cookie. But there's a time for thought, and there's a time for action. And this is one of those times. Which? The second one. 
<laughs> Perhaps you're right, 137. Of course I'm right. You kidding me? A cryptosporidium captured by a bunch of monkeys? We gotta go in. We gotta crack some craniums. We gotta rescue me. Him. He's gotta rescue me. I mean, we gotta... I gotta... Brains, man. When do I get to blow things up? Patience, Crypto. Patience. I take your point. Prepare the mothership. That's what I'm talking about. So, what's the name of this crummy planet? Our destination. The planet Earth. Welcome to my little laboratory. You may not have known this, but I flatter myself to be something of an inventor. In my spare time, I've been developing some truly impressive weapon and ability upgrades. I'd be happy to share them with you. If you've got something for me in trade, say some of that delicious DNA you've collected. Hmm? Mm, you always gotta make it weird, Poxy. Okay, let's jump right into it. Now, I do have the, um... I do have tutorials on, like I said earlier, and that's mainly for me to kind of get up to speed on everything about it. So far, I'm very impressed with the graphics. They're incredible. I can tell the voice actors are a little bit different, but, I mean, obviously, they're going to have to be because they, they couldn't get the same people. Like, the mothership is just crazy. Oh, look at that little smirk. Ortho box to Cryptosporidium 137. Come in, Cryptosporidium. Crypto here. How's the view from the safety of the mothership? Very funny. Let's just say I'm glad I'm up here and you're down there. Loathsome little planet. Now, Crypto! To ensure this invasion runs smoothly, it is imperative we identify the dominant life forms on this world. Those lactating bovoids are likely candidates. Surely you don't mean those foul-smelling gas bags beyond the fence. Yes, I'm afraid I do. But they're covered in nipples. Now, Cryptosporidium! And Crypto! Do verify your suit is working under Earth's atmospheric conditions. Get a move on! Oh, I love it. Look at it. It's so good. Oh my god, look at the shit on the back of my head pulsate. Oof. My god, look at this dude's vertical. It's crazy. Alright. We can peer into the minds of lower life forms via the cortex scan. Rip the preliterate thoughts from their pathetic little brains. Moo. Primitive, yet profound. Scan another one. I'm gonna use that very soon. When someone says something, I'm going to say, hmm, primitive. 
yet profound. Again with the moo? I think these lactating bovoids are trying to fool us. They eat with their mouths? Ugh, I think I'm going to be violently ill. Attention, Earth creatures. This planet is now part of the Furon Empire. Your benevolent masters welcome you. At this time, we wish to abduct you for the purpose of scientific research. The procedure will be protracted and invasive. Do you have any objections? Earth creature, I am addressing you. Respond or be vaporized. I don't care how many stomachs you have. I don't have time for this. Mm. With your all Got of shit on. the astounding power of psychokinesis, Crypto, target an object or creature, then lift it into the sky. Use PK to finish off the belligerent bovines. Slam them into the ground. Perfect! Curse these creatures! Yay. Mm, Martha, you didn't tell me we was having barbecue for dinner. Oh my god, look at his teeth. Wait a minute, that ain't steak. That's holy mother of... Martha, give me the shotgun. This looks like a job for the Zapomatic. Fry that fire. Extract and collect the brainstem from what's left of the agricultural engineer. Agricultural engineer. <laughs> the brainstem and collect the furon DNA. It's great. Come on back, you gotta see this! They got a talking horse on the TV! I ain't never seen nothing like... Ah! Little green spaceman! Ah! I am not green. I mean, I'd get pissed off too. Like, let's be honest here. Okay, shields. Okay, so you still pretty much die when you touch water, in like an ocean or some shit like that. Okay. Be merciless. Let none survive. Alright, not bad. I don't have the jet. What's this? Yet. Communist Russia? Good work, Crypto! Yay! Evening, Ms. Turnip Seed. We got a call from Farmer Dixon over the other side of the state road. Said he heard some pretty strange noises coming from over this way. Little green spaceman! What oh, is oh, that? A new silo? Electrocuted him with a big arm! Crypto! That uh, human law enforcement officer is attempting an unauthorized entry of your spacecraft. If those pea brains were to get their hands on your quantum deconstructor, they could rip a hole in the space time continuum. Boo the Furonity! Vaporize them, Crypto! Yay, I got the jetpack now. Uh. What am I objective? Ooh, kill the farmer's wife using a chicken. Don't fucking mind if I do. Stop! Superb! Ah! <laughs> my radar shows more humans approaching. Hurry to the Get in your flying saucer and annihilate everything in your path. Take a spin in your saucer. I've been told there's a couple of new things about the saucer. Go ahead and start shooting! Destroy all buildings! Leave no trace! Bomb those monkeys back to the stone age! So far, 
are so good. I love the death ray animation. He's good as gold. Oh, great. The human military industrial complex. We can't allow them to alert their leaders to our presence. Exterminate them! Now! Open fire! Well, okay then. Crypto, I hereby give you official permission to destroy all humans. Saucer's a little bit squirrely, but... I like it, in general. Look out! There are more to the north in the bushes! Replenish your saucer's shields by draining any human vehicle. Superb! Okay, can I just... Okay. Oh, shit. Oh my god, I fucking dodged that shit. The humans are making a final push! Wipe them out once and for all! Can I abduct them? What the hell? What is it? No fucking way. It shoots it straight down. Perfect! I can... I can attack while I'm taking shield. It's called the duty next it needs to take a fucking page of these people's book. Excellent work, Crypto. Did you see what I saw? You bet your sweet ass I did. What did you see? Little green man in a flying saucer wiping out the best infantry unit in the U.S. Army. Right, good. Me too. Green? Not gray? Don't be a stiff. You know what it means? Absolutely. What? It means the papers got it right for once. Get on the horn to Silhouette. We've got the worst case scenario. The eggheads were actually onto something? I don't believe it. Believe it. Roswell was only the beginning. The invasion is on. We've all got that one friend. Sweet. Dis former disappears amidst cow abuse allegations. <laughs> oh my god. Now then, I know what you're thinking. What can I, a lowly novice, do to help bring about the destruction of Earth and the inevitable reign of the Furon Empire? Well, I'll tell you. It was in the earliest days of the Empire we realized our species was doomed. Eons of waging war on inferior races with unregulated atomic weaponry had mutated our genes. We could not propagate due to our complete and utter lack of genitalia. Fortunately, a Furon ship happened upon Earth on its way back from destroying the Martians. Human society was young and nubile. 
Sailors on a foreign planet, letting off steam, one thing led to another. Long story short, every human being alive today has buried deep in his genetic code a strand of Furon DNA. Over the eons, we've learned to clone ourselves, but with each iteration, the information degrades, and the results are increasingly unpredictable. The Furon genes in humanity's DNA are ancient, uncorrupted. They represent the future of the Furon race. If only we can get at them. A saucer upgrade, perhaps? No? How about your gun? Or your abilities? Mm? Not, not yet, Poxy. <clears throat> All right. Challenge unlocked. Ooh, okay. Oh, that mothership is beautiful. Miss Multiverse, Mr. Multiverse. Oh my lord, it's great. Crypto, I see a horde of humans up ahead, congregating at some sort of holy ground. Here's the plan. I want you to enter the fair, find a malleable human and lead it back to your ship for questioning. Get the picture. Crypto! That human is aware of your presence. The more people become aware of you, the more chance that those human policemen and the military will come to investigate you and take you down. Don't forget to disguise yourself. Holobob. I remember this. Yeah. Pretty now forward. that you're sufficiently disguised, continue using the cortex scan to maintain the illusion. You wouldn't want to lose concentration while surrounding enemies. Enemies. That cow's starting to look a little too good. Fuck me. To serve and protect, to serve and protect, to serve and protect, to swerve and defect, to curve and perfect. Damn it, I lost it. <laughs> To swerve what we and need defect. Is the dumbest, weakest willed, most malleable human we can find. Admittedly, the competition will be fierce. You just have to scan them all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Town's doing great. Business is booming. Hope is on the way. Yada, yada, yada. Let's uh, barrel through this puppy so I can get down to the real business of governing. Making time with the delicious Miss Rockwell. This human seems to be onto something. Will no wonders never cease. Keep scanning the humans. And don't forget the marvelous change. With the hoops and the milk bar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Town's doing great. Business is booming. Hope is on the way. Yada, yada, yada. Let's uh, barrel through this puppy so I can get down to the real business of governing. Making time with the delicious Miss Rockwell. Oh, yes. I'm a man in charge. Finally, I was going to flip my lid if Mama made me take one more slurp of cabbage soup. I want roast chicken. Mmm, chicken of the sea. Or was it by the sea? All right, Crypto. I have analyzed all the thoughts you've collected, and I think I've isolated the perfect subject for you to probe and vaporize. No. Abduct and bring back to the mothership. My way's more fun. Abduct, not vaporize. Okay, but humanity ain't gonna annihilate itself, all I'm saying. Can I finish? Can I stop you? As I was saying, the newly crowned Miss Rockwell looks like a prime candidate for testing. She's envied and desired by other humans. She's highly persuadable. Best of all, she apparently has a brain the size of a peanut. Hypnotize her and send her back to your ship for collection. <laughs> My way's more fun. Implant a command on a puny human brain. Bend its will to ours. I want to thank all the little people, but there's no time. Gotta go! I want to thank all the little people.
Which way is the exit? Oh, Jesus. Enjoy the fair. Oh, and don't ride the mangler. It's a freaking death trap. I guess the mangler is a death trap. Must I I just... keep going. Feet killing me. Damn heels. Wait, I left my purse in the tent. I guess I can just I keep locked on to her to the and in mysterious woods. There's no reason to be afraid. Nothing bad is ever that happens dude? to people who go into dark oh and mysterious God, he is. woods. He's straight watching Especially people bang in that car. Or slasher films. Not that I know what those are. Nope. Nothing to worry about here. I don't remember parking here. Of course, I can't ever remember where I parked. My car seems bigger. And rounder. And saucer shaped. <laughs> la 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 la. La 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 And lots of wavy hair like Libera Wait a minute Where am I? This sure doesn't look like the pie eating contest Uh oh Uh oh What's happening? Oh god please no Oh oh it, it tickles <laughs> It's probing time. Oh, yeah, right there. That's the spot. Oh, that is delicious. Ugh, creepy. Never fails. I love it how he's already just annoyed by the cops. Like, right Great, off the Crypto. Bat. The authorities are on their way. Get it's in great. your saucer. Wreak havoc by using your saucer's abducto beam to levitate a creature or object. Okay. Sweet. Fairground left in tatters by freak storm. Okay. Wait, what is this? Miss Rocco committed to Shady Pine Sanitarium. Did you want a saucer upgrade? Or something a little more personal? Mm. Okay, you can drop the mmm at the end. Alright, let's not make this creepier than it needs to be. I, however, am going to end it there. Got a couple of missions done. Not too much, not too little. Um, I'm probably going to record the next episode right now, though. So, thank you guys for being a part of it. Um... I'm in love with this game. I always have been. You know, the whole franchise. I actually bought a Wii just to play Big Willie Unleashed. Uh, which, I mean, I hope they remake them all. That would be badass. Uh, like I said, not as much commentary because th th this has a lot of funny shit in it. So I usually try to let all that just kind of flow. But this is going to be... I'm going to try to post a video at least once every two days on this just because I want to get this out there like this 
this is this is what really does it for me as a game. It's funny. There's destruction. There's violence. Um, but it's not just like blood and gore and shit like that. So it's there's kind of a middle ground, you know. Right? I'm you know reminding you guys this is rated T for teens. So I mean it's it's definitely not very hardcore, but it's still super fun and definitely worth playing. So if you guys like it, drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Especially if you guys want to see more of this, because I can promise you there's going to be. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one.